T-bills could be your worst investment. I'm Brent Wilsey with Wilsey Asset Management. Right off the bat, you're thinking, how could they say such a thing? Warren Buffett has hundreds of billions of dollars in T-bills. Why do we think it's the worst investment? Well, first off, Warren Buffett spends all day long reading, researching, analyzing, and when he sees a good value investment, he will likely sell what he needs from the T-bills to buy those good long-term investments. If you are someone that needs the money in two to three years, then this belief, it does not apply to you as T-bills are a great place to have your short-term money. But if you're a longer-term investor and you want your money to grow for you, I worry that T-bills are not a great place for you. What will likely happen is that you will feel safe for a while especially when the correction comes, which it will. You'll be glad you have money in T-bills, but you probably won't pull the trigger when lower equity prices arrive because you feel comfortable with the safety and no volatility of your T-bills. Unfortunately, what will then happen down the road is you will eventually get tired of getting a low return as interest rates drop and your T-bills only earning two, maybe 3% you will likely then want to move to something else and maybe do something silly like look at the past performance of equities and buy after stocks go back up after the correction. When it comes to investing, be sure you use the right tool for the right job. A T-bill is not the right tool for long-term investors unless you really are a skilled investor and know how to navigate the volatility in equities. Stay ahead in the investment world by subscribing to our YouTube channel and weekly newsletter for the latest economic news, expert analysis, and market insights.